breaking news from Channel 13 Eyewitness News. And tonight at 5, we begin with that breaking news. The teenager who shot and killed this young husband, Nathan Trapezano, on his morning walk weeks before the birth of his first child is going to prison. That teenage gunman is now pleading guilty to the crime. Eyewitness News reporter Naomi Peskovitz joins us live with this major development in this investigation. Naomi. Scott and Ann, I spoke with Nathan's mom earlier today. She, told, she tells me that they did come to this agreement just a few days ago, earlier this week, and that the family feels okay with this decision. Though she feels they'll never have true justice for Nathan, this is an agreement that they could live with. And now Simeon Adams, who was only six 16 years old at the time of the murder has agreed to plead guilty to that murder charge with carries a sentence of 45 to 65 years in prison. The other charges in this case will in turn be dropped. Adams will officially be sentenced next month. The prosecutor's office anticipates that sentence will be 55 years in prison. However, based on former Indiana statute, he could serve only half of that time based on good behavior. Because Adams was only 16 at the time, Marion County Prosecutor Terry Curry he says this was the longest sentence they could expect. We're told he did not speak during that hearing today. Adams is also facing an attempted murder charge in another case where he is accused of shooting a man just days before the attack on Nathan. The prosecutor's office tells us that case is still pending. In fact, he will have a pre-trial hearing the same day he'll be sentenced in Nathan Trapezano's murder. Now, Nathan's mother, Cheryl, who lives in Pittsburgh, says they will continue to honor Nathan's life. Trapezano when he breathed his last breath. Um, at this point, I think it was more about our justice system and how it works or fails to work. And after some discussion, this was presented to us, and um, we felt that at least it was a sure thing. We are entirely pleased that uh, uh, Simeon Adams uh, has acknowledged that uh, he intentionally killed Mr. Trapezano that day, and, and this sentence is clearly exactly in the range that we expect, even if we got a conviction at trial. And Nathan Trapezano leaves behind a one-year-old daughter, Cecilia, who was born just weeks after his death. His young wife, Jennifer, and his family, they have now started a foundation to honor him and to help other young people who are missing parents at home. You'll hear much more from Nathan's mom coming up at 6 and also tonight on The Night Beat. Reporting live downtown, Naomi Peskovitz, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.